and it's time for the daily Ryan beating. Here's the key, girl. <gasps> we have a lot to tell you, but you're gonna have to hang on. <sighs> there he is. Cicadas are c crawling out of the ground. All right, Kate, good luck. Thanks. What are you doing? SAT. Go. <laughs> Nervous? Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. Natural, huh? I mean, not really, but like, I'd rather be at home with my bed. Right, I don't blame you. Yeah. All right, do the best you can, right? <clears throat> yeah. Did a lot of good prep, that's excellent. Yeah. Beat can pads? I piece of gum? Yes. It's gonna save me, Dad. I'm sure your classmates will appreciate that. I brushed my teeth. All right, all right. Good wow, luck. Wow, everyone brought like full lunches and everything. Whoa. Oh my gosh, Gavin. Okay, I gotta go. All right, love you. Love you more. Good luck. Bye. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> love that girl. Good luck, bud. All right, here Appreciate we are it. at Ryan's Golf. This is his first tournament with his new bag and his new clubs. First tournament of the season. Okay. Other than high school golf, but. This is my, uh, this is the training season. Yeah. Spring. This is for my spring training. Oh, okay, for what? Yeah. For fall for, golf? For, uh, for fall uh, high school. Fantastic. And what hole are you starting on? We're starting on number one of the rivers. Okay, oh, nice. So, where's that? Oh, it's across uh, the street, right? Do you want me to drive you there? No. I've never seen the Rivers course before. Oh, That's exciting. Beautiful. Yeah, no. Excellent. Good. And who are you playing with? Uh, Bailey. So. Oh, good. All right. So, I'm pretty excited. Excellent. All right. Well, good luck. Uh, golf partner won the match. Congratulations. Go. Alright, Ryan came home and <clears throat> took a quick shower and then went off to a friend's birthday party. I just dropped him there and now I'm picking Katie up. She's at her friend Alyssa's house. I guess they were laying out all day and swimming. And we are going to come home. She texted me. She's like, Mom, I just want to watch a movie with you. So we're going to come home. Mike's making dinner. Brennan's still working. <laughs> but, um, Mike's making dinner, so Kate and I are going to have some dinner with Mike and then snuggle up, hopefully on the cove, which is outside. We'll put a TV on the outside um, porch, and we're going to watch a movie. I'm sure it's a Disney movie. I'm not sure which one it's going to be, though. We wanted to watch one last night, but she, she wanted we wanted to watch one last night, but we laid down to watch it, and she got really tired. She's like, I have to go to bed because she was taking SATs today. So I was, like, totally in favor of her going to sleep. And both of us were not feeling so well, so um, we needed a rest. So I hope you guys are doing well, and I hope none of you have this cold that I have, and that Katie has, and that Ryan has, I think, successfully staved off. He had a couple days. Hopefully, he's on the, on the mend, and it's going on the upswing and not the downswing. That would be good. Um, anyway, we will see you later. But maybe around dinner time, maybe when Brendan is home from, home from work. But that's what we're doing today. It's a, been a glorious Saturday so far. The weather is spectacular, and... Um, yeah, we've, that's it. That's not really it. We have a lot to tell you, but you're gonna have to hang on. <laughs> Cause we've got a lot of things working on in the background right now. A lot of surprises. So um, it's been hard to keep it from you guys. It's been hard to keep it from the kids. So don't tell the kids, but um, stay tuned over the next couple weeks. And I think you'll be excited. Hopefully as excited as we are. Okay. That's all I can say. Here's the key girl. <gasps> <laughs> you do look tan. I was telling her you laid out today. Do you laid out at Elena's or Alyssa's? Um, on Elena's boat. On Elena's boat. That sounds like fun. And let me tell you. It was a gorgeous day. You guys know how the cicadas are taking over? Yes. What They're in the water. <gasps> they are not. Yes. That's disgusting. Yes. Are they swimming? Can they no. swim? They fly into the water, lay on their backs, <gasps> like 
get nice and cool down and then fly out of the water. No yes. way! And let me They're going to take you. over. They're evolving. Let me tell you what happened. What? I was laying out. Minding my business. Yeah. I'm just going to say it. A cicada flew into my crotch area. Oh no! Oh yep. no! Oh yep. no! Oh, I've no. never moved so fast in my entire life. <laughs> I, I bet got freaked up you out. so fast. <laughs> yes, it did. In fact, it freaked screaming. me out. I got up quicker than I ever have before. Oh my gosh. Um, I saw the cicada on the seat and I, I flicked it as hard as I could. Oh my god. Hoping gosh. that maybe it would just croak, but it didn't. It flew away. And I was like, you should be jailed for that. Oh my gosh. Okay, explain to everybody who does not live in our area what a cicada is. Oh, maybe? Like, I don't think the people in, like, England, like... I don't think they know. Cicadas are you these put gods. It in the video before. I can put the picture in again. Yeah. And so, when I was just being born... 17 years ago. 17 years ago. A bunch of cicadas decided to um, lay eggs in the ground. Um, every 17 years, they come out of the ground. So... <coughs> this particular wave happened on the east coast of the United States 17 years ago, and they come out day. May, June, July. So all May, June, July of this year, cicadas are c crawling out of the ground. They're like they, they're like bugs. They're like that big. They have they're huge so, waves, uh, and they make noises. And they, they so yeah. loud noises. They say it's like a hundred decibels. Yeah, it is. I mean, it's, it's really insane. Loud. Like when we're driving through the neighborhood. Like, it was really, me and Caden were driving, like, from, like, out of our house. And it's so loud on that, like, on that By street. By the park? Yeah, because yes. the trees are yes. down. So, because I like to hang out in trees. So we were just, um, no, the cicadas, not me I thought you said I like to hang out in trees. <laughs> the cicadas. So we were driving, and it was really hot, because Caden's car, like, had to turn on to start the air conditioning. So I was like, I'll just roll down a window. So I rolled down a window, and it's like, Bang! Making all these noises, and I was like, no, 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 no. no. So they had to roll back up. It was disgusting. That is funny. Yeah. All right, but other than that, you had a good time? Yes, other than the cicada incident. Yes. Okay, got it. All right, well, Dad's making dinner. And Today's been a long day. Yes, Far you started early. Uh -huh. Hey, do we have any oh. video of you since then? I don't know. Tell everybody how your so. SATs went. I think it went really well. I'm praying that it went really well. It went better than last time you did, Yes, right? it did go better than last time. Also, can we please stop at Molly's house to get my pole? Oh. Because that would be really bad if banana. I forgot it. Yes, yeah. okay, yes, we can. We will do that. That's very good. Katie has had a week off of pole vault from her club, and they pick back up tomorrow, so now it's summer session. Start back tomorrow. Give it a four, wait, a four-hour practice tour. Four hours? Why? Ten to one is your inner is your regular football, and then an hour of conditioning. Oh yeah. yeah. All right, you guys, stay tuned. All right, can you guys hear the cicadas? They're so loud. That's the cicadas. All right, we just returned home for a little bit of a. I wouldn't even call it a grocery haul, but I picked Katie up from her. Um, our grocery haul. Yes. I picked Katie up from doing her sign language classes today. She was teaching the kids. And she saw their little lunches and she's like, all I want is a peanut butter and jelly. All I want is a peanut lunch. Yes. Okay. So here we are. We went to get peanut butter and jelly and ended up with lots and lots of other <laughs> fancies. All right, we got triscuits, shake ingredients, crackers, Velveeta, cookies. Of course, cookies and ice cream. Cookies and ice cream. And we're going to make... Peanut butter and jelly. We're going to make um, chicken noodle soup, and we're going to make stir fry chicken tonight for dinner. So we got it all. And we got strawberries and cheese and crackers. <clears throat> Yum. That's what was in a lot of the kids' lunches, and I was like, "Ooh, that looks good." <laughs> <laughs> so we're having a straight up elementary school lunch today. Being everything you hoped and dreamed it would be. Well, it looks like everything I hoped and dreamed it would be. I just don't know if it tastes like everything I have been doing So, should we do a little, a little taste test? Mm-hmm. Little red raspberry preserves with peanut butter and honey bread. You happy? This reminds me of elementary school lunch. Mm-hmm. That's what it is. Mm-hmm. Nice job. Bon appetit. There he is. There's Brennan, you guys. 
So we ordered some signs. We get to put them in the yard, little yard signs. We never did this when we were kids. Did you do this, Mike? No, I think it's a pandemic. Actually, I've seen it the past few years. Um, it actually, you know what? Maybe it did start last year. I don't know. I feel like I've seen it before the pandemic. Maybe I'm wrong. So we got a standard one and then one with his picture on it. Oh my gosh. And his cap and gown right over here. I'm just going to wait and have Brennan show you this, but he's at work and he um, is not going to be home for a while. So look at, there's his 21 tassel. This is his cap. Oh my goodness. And his gown's all folded up, so I'm not going to unfold it. But also, he's, he's graduating magna cum laude because he has a 4.22 GPA. And he's supposed to get a silver, like, stool thing he didn't get. So um, they're going to hopefully be giving it to us. I emailed his guidance counselor. But there's Brennan. He had to turn in all of his books and everything. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. You know what? I hope he got these graduation tickets, too. So I hope they're downstairs. Ooh, let me go check on that. Hold on. All right, here they are, our graduation tickets and our parking pass. So they get, we get to have four people at Brennan's graduation. So it's going to be, of course, Mike and me and Katie and Ryan. And my parents are coming, but they're not gonna be able to go to graduation, but we're gonna have dinner before that and then have some people over to the house after for a celebration. So that should be fun. That's on Tuesday of next week. It's also my mom's birthday that day. So we'll be celebrating mom's birthday as well. All right, Brennan, on the other hand, I will tell you, has three jobs this summer. He just started his third job yesterday. Today was his second job, second day at his second job, and he's working at the golf course. So I'll let him tell you about his jobs when he gets home because I'm so proud of him. He's kind of working a lot, but I'm proud of him for um, going after it. He's trying to make as much money as he can this summer for college. All right, Mike, what do you got? Anything? I'm thinking about a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I think that sounds like a pretty good idea. Boop. <laughs> All right, Brennan has arrived home from work, and it's time for the daily Ryan beating. Here we go. Uh, can't look up zombies. <laughs> <laughs> and you're, I, I know, Katie and I, and Ryan, Ryan's got it too. We have. Have you guys heard of the TikTok sickness? <laughs> Is it from yeah. I don't know how I have a TikTok sickness. I don't even watch TikTok. It's not about TikTok. No. <laughs> TikTok. I'm like, it would also been feeling that, like this, but it's not, it's not coronavirus, it's not mono, and it's not strep. But everyone just feels like. Got this cold. It's cold. It's, it's like, worse than a cold. It is. Dad thought cold. maybe I had the flu. The I flu? Know. Maybe. I don't, I don't think know. I have the flu because I hope not. Uh oh, what's that? Yeah. He can't look. He's beating up his brother. Sick, tough kid. Brandon, I think Katie wants you to look at the uh, at her phone. Oh, I don't know. He's not listening. Hey, Brandon, how was work today? All right, we'll get we'll get back to Brennan on that. <laughs> it was good. It was good. Yes. So Brennan worked for. Is this your first time working at that at that restaurant? Correct. And you worked for hours. And the benefit is he got to eat two meals. He said his first meal was chicken nuggets, and his second or chicken strips. And his second meal was a fillet and tuna with asparagus and a big potato. Okay, I guess that's it. I forget. I'm just sort of talking. <laughs> All right, Ryan, what, Ryan, what made you happy today, honey? I'm not in the best state to answer that question right now. What made you happy today, Brandon? A uh, good first day of work. Excellent. Ah. What made you happy today, Katie Elizabeth? Uh, mm -hmm. oh. What? Oh. Hang off, Katie. You know, oh, that's mm -hmm. nice. Okay. And okay. what made me happy today is um, I had coffee with my friend. Oh. It was very nice. Yes, so we had a cup of coffee and a cup of tea. And the tea was with your Oh, 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 oh. All right, you guys. Hope you guys had a wonderful day. Oh, and um, I think I think Brennan getting his graduation stuff made me happy, but it also makes me sad, but I'm very proud of him. So anyway, comment below. Made you guys happy today. We hope you have a wonderful day, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.